Hello, my name is Reginald, and welcome to another edition of Microsoft Office Access 2007 tutorial. In this tutorial, you will learn how to create a table by linking to an Excel 2007 workbook. This will be accomplished by meeting the following objectives. Use the Microsoft Northwind Traders database, also known as Northwind2007.accdb. Preview and use the Excel 2007 New Products Workbook. Show worksheets. The first row contains column headings. Name the new link table New Products. And finally, view and verify your results. Well, let's get started. Let's open up Excel 2007 and familiarize ourselves with the new products workbook. As you can see, we have a ID, product code, product name, list price, quantity per unit, and category. Now that we've taken a brief moment to familiarize ourselves with some of the data in this table, Let's go up above and locate the Office button and select it. And let's come down and click Close. Now let's open up Microsoft Office Access 2007. And let's scroll all the way to the top. And let's go to the right until we locate the External Data tab, which is right here. Let's select it. And let's come down to Import and let's select the Excel icon. Now it's time to navigate to our Excel workbook so let's come to the right and let's click on browse. And here our workbook is right here new products so let's double click on it. And now let's scroll down to where it says link to data source by creating a link table and let's click on it. Now let's come down and let's click on OK. And we were asked to show worksheets so let's leave this selected as it is. And let's come down and click on next. And we were asked to Show first row contains column headings, so let's leave that checked as it is as well. And let's come down and click on Next. And we were asked to name our new link table, New Products, so let's do that. And let's come down and click on Finish. And right here it asked, it says, Finish Linking Table. Let's click OK. Now let's go over to the navigation pane and let's come up to all access objects and let's come below and let's click on tables. And now let's scroll down until we locate our new products table. And this is it right here. And you'll also take note of the new symbol. This is the symbol for a link table. So let's double click on it and view and verify the results of our new link table. And as we can see, we have an ID, product code, product name, list price, quantity per unit, category. Well, our new link table looks fantastic. Praise the Lord. This has been another Microsoft Office Access 2007 tutorial with Reginald. Thank you.